The Edo governorship election slated for the 19th day of September 2020 has been won and lost. This is the position of no less a person than the Edo-born business magnate, investor, philanthropist and trained commercial pilot, Captain Idahosa Wells Okumbo. He made this declaration during an interactive press conference in Abuja, which he called to respond to the many questions arising from his involvement in the forthcoming governorship election. Captain Osa, as he is fondly called, said that on the surface, judging by the ubiquity of his campaign posters and billboards, the incumbent governor, Godwin Obaseki, seems to be leading the pack, whereas in reality, he has no foothold in Edo politics. I'm 63 years old. I wasn't ready to start learning new things. You see, and that is one of the reasons why I tried to help Godwin, because in his old age, because he couldn't learn new things, that's why he fell a victim. He couldn't learn new things because he found himself in politics, which he is not. And he will have seen for God with God's wisdom to be able to manage the position he have found himself. So many people were ready to talk to him. And I was there. I was one of the people trying to mediate the this whole matter. I never wanted him to fight anybody. Not to talk about fighting me. Now, when he started fighting the political class and all that, I told him, I said, look, Gio, what's in my house? I said, please. If you keep fighting these guys, they have a boss who is Comrade Adams Oshomole. And very soon, you and Adams will quarrel. He said, no, say, God forbid. For him and Adams to quarrel. He will design in the government. On why he is deeply involved in the Edo 2020 governorship election, the business mogul explained that he wants to liberate the state from an elected governor who rules like an emperor since he has no other place to call home but Edo. See how our state has been managed. See the personality of the governor that has ruled them. See the violence and the quarrels and the fights that have happened. You know, I said, has it gone well? Let every man search their content, function. Like I said, it's not about money. If my people believe that this election is about money, well, let their conscience be sold. But me, Dr. Nosa, I would have played my part. He said, play your part. I would have played my part. Because if they're happy with what they see, if they're happy the way they've been, they've been treated in the past four years and they think somebody will come and induce them to sell their conscience on election day and carry the virus and they want to continue in that suffering. So be it. The recent spate of politically motivated violence in the state was also on the front burner. According to the retired pilot, Edo State has held several elections in the past, but the 2020 edition of the governorship election has gained notoriety for the unprecedented level of thuggery and attacks against the APC. I still consider Godwin my brother. I still consider him my brother. But I don't consider him a leader. Because he does not have the attributes of leadership. Our place, in those things. It's a collective responsibility. It's a place where we all must support. I have no other place to go to. I have no other place I can call my foundation apart from that place. It's more important to me than any other place. 
He lacks leadership. And he also lacks the temperament, the patience to be able to rule over his people. He's deceitful. I can say that. When asked how he will recoup his money spent during the campaign, Captain Osa said, for him, the reward for supporting a competent and trusted leader for Edo State is much more than financial, noting that himself and the APC candidate come a long way. When God wants to walk, God will bring all together to support you. I happen to be on the side today. I want another question that you may ask. It's okay. You are supporting him now, financially. How do you take to recoup back your money, isn't it? That's the next question. Yeah. People are asking this question. And what have I told them? Red Cross. Red Cross. What do I mean by Red Cross? Charity. If today I give or I support Osage Zayari financially to liberate my state, and tomorrow I'm not expecting him for a state that they have really they have really cold with debts. They borrowed money, our state is in a state of almost, I don't know, people should go and find out the records about their state. Our state is in debt. Our children have been obeyed. Like a colossus, Captain Idahosa Wells Okumbo, the Benin born billionaire business mogul, straddles not only the economic but also the socio cultural and political topographies within and outside Edo State. He enjoys the goodwill of a vast majority of Edo people. For picking a fight with Captain Osa, Governor Godwin Obaseki could very well have shot himself in the head. Vivian Okeya, reporting.